Hey guys, this is Prince Jaya Kenya back again today with another video. Thanks for keeping in touch and thanks for coming to check back once more. So today I want to speak to those people that whenever they are given an advice, whenever people want to correct them, they always take it on a negative note. They always take it on a on a long perspective. They always think that the people that are advising them, they are against them and they are they are they are enemies, right? So today I want to speak to you. You know, the, the, in this life you are living, you're gonna make mistake. You're gonna make. You're gonna. You, you're gonna have some errors here and there because we are all human. And as a human, you have to do mistake. Accept yourself and accept that the fact. As a human, sometimes you're gonna go on a long direction. As a human, sometimes you're gonna go on a long path. As a human, you you have to do mistake. And then whenever you do mistake, you you don't wanna dwell in that mistake you don't want to live in that mistake right you don't want to live in that you know so there is a way that god always come to correct us there is a way god comes to tell you that this is wrong and this is right leave going this direction and go to this direction because god's intention towards our life it's always good and positive right so god always one thing that we're gonna accept is that god will never come to speak to you directly you will never see angels coming to speak to you like, bro, <laughs> I am an angel sent by God. It will never happen. God will always speak to your inner self, to your inner man. But in many situations that, the, the way that God is talking to you through your inner person, same way the Satan is coming to speak to you through your inner person. And most of the time, the, the, the Satan voice is going to outdo the God's voice because God's voice is going to tell you, stop this thing you are doing. But Satan's voice is going to come to give you a million reason to continue doing the same thing you are doing. Maybe you are doing the wrong thing, but certain voice is going to come and speak with a loud voice and tell you it's okay to do it. It's okay. It's all right to do it, right? So after that fails, God going to use people to come and correct you. Those are the angels God, God going to use. God going to use angels. God going to use angels which are people. And then people going to come and tell you, this is wrong. Your life is messed up. Your life is in danger. Don't stop Stop going this direction. Stop doing this thing. They have their effect later, later days. And then whenever all that thing happens, most of the people think that these people are our enemies. These people that are our enemies, our progress. These people don't want to see us happy. And then the only thing that you do is disgust them and then... Or, or, or say, you know what, I live my life, live your life, mind about your business, let me mind my business. And then you cut, you, cut your, you cut the ties for you with those people. But at one day, whenever things happen, right, whenever things happen and all the things that people want you about comes, to, comes with a consequence because every reaction has a consequence, every decision has a consequence. That's when you're going to start to remember all those people who try to direct all those people who try to save you all those people who try to advise you but you could not listen to them so please 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 is my agent my great advice whenever some people whenever anybody come to give you an advice whether on a positive note or a, or, or, a, or a negative note just take heed listen to the person right listen to the person and then when you are by yourself call yourself a meeting and ask yourself this question what was the intention of that person coming to advise me was it a positive intention? Was it a negative intention? Because your inner person gonna speak to you and they're gonna let you know. They're gonna, you know, in, inside ourselves we have some judges. The inner man is our judge and he's gonna let you know. To be honest, that person was trying to help you. Even if you don't like the person, even if you don't love the person, but that person was here to help you. And then you, you, all you need is to take, to, to take responsibility of your own action, right? Start praying God to help you to overcome that thing. Because this is it. We cannot do anything by ourselves. There are some things we cannot overcome by ourselves. There are some things we need the power of God. There are some things we need the mighty power of Jesus Christ, right? We cannot do it by ourselves. So ask God to help you. Ask God to give you wisdom. To choose the right and the wrong thing. Ask God to give the confidence to, to walk away from that thing. From that thing that is making your life not to move on, from that thing that is making your life to get stuck, from that thing that is hindering you to 
lead to your destiny from that thing that is hindering you to work on your purpose tell god to help you out and listen to people's voice listen to yourself listen to your inner man overcome that sound that is telling you that it's okay to do it overcome that sound that is telling you that you know what at the end of all of it everybody is doing it overcome that voice that is telling you that you are having fun you can have fun in a way that doesn't affect you that the a fun that doesn't affect your future because if you focus on having fun that is affecting your future now you are being brightful then not to see many ways you can be happy even without doing the same thing you are doing so may god help you to overcome that thing you are you you you, you have been trying to fight for a long time may god help you to listen to people's advice may god help you to choose be between the positive people's advice and negative people's advice do away with the negative people's advice but heed and listen to positive people's advice and get may god help you to make a decision that will be a life changing and a game changer to your life and one day you're gonna look back and say it was hard for me to make this decision but at the end of all of it i thank god he helped me out and i thank myself i took heed and i took a decision because my life would be in a mess but right now my life is all well together in one piece thank you and god bless you